third inning, Kirby Puckett leads things off for the American League. Then Ricky Henderson and Wade Boggs. The Americans on top 2-0 as Puckett fouls it back. And the count on Kirby is 0-2. Puckett, in his first two big league seasons, had a total of four homers. None his first year, four his second, and already 16 midway this year. Well, they made a change, moved him up on the plate. You can see him on top of the plate. And I, I think the pitchers have adjusted now because early in the year he was, as we look at two old timers, Vice President George Bush on your right and Rusty Stop. Stop is the honorary captain and one of the original Houston Colt 45 as he dons the replica of the uniform. And Don Drysdale is with us tonight. He'll be talking with the vice president in the next half inning. Bucket fouling it away, one and two, with Henderson waiting on deck. And then Box to follow. And Fernando Valenzuela, who will follow Good, loosens up in the bullpen. Yeah. Puckett with a shot at a batting title this year. Boggs leads the league in hitting. Mattingly is second. And then Kirby third at 338. Well, he came up as a, basically a contact hitter. Just tried to hit it down on the turf in Minnesota. This year, Oliva did change him. And if you look at his build, you can see that he hit the ball a long way. Three and two to the count. The thing about this all-star team, or this all-star game, it has a lot of players that are so well-rounded, good defensively, good offensively. Kirby Puckett, for instance. Take a look at Gooden. Kirby Puckett led the American League in assists two years ago, second last year. The shallow right field, and it's Strawberry putting it away. So well-rounded on both ends. A lot of gold gloves. 